Hey there, folks. My name is Feldre, and we are back in SevTech. So, <laughs> I know you guys might be getting sick of Astral Sorcery already, um, and I have I have been doing some stuff off screen with, to do with that. Uh, I'm probably not going to go too much further. I we'll see. Um, what I really what I was really going for was um, I wanted two things. I wanted the uh the Visio wand um which is made here that'd be really nice to have and i would also like uh the Visio mantle which is this one the reason i would like these is because basically they they'd grant me flight <laughs> not not like creative flight but certainly uh, like, better than what I've got, which is nothing. <laughs> which is slime boots, that's, that's what I have right now. Uh, so, I, if, if I, I'm not sure about making Mantle of the Stars, but I at least really want to make the Resonating Wand, uh, the, the Visio Re Resonating Wand, because that will launch me through the air. And that, even just with slime boots, that's going to be so handy for traveling around. So I really want to make that. So, um, yeah, so I'm working a little bit on that. I got a whole bunch of of starlight, as you can see here. Um, okay, so in order to make this, I need the iridescent altar. I have all this stuff except for the celestial crystal. So what I did was we come over here. Uh, basically, I made some holes in the ground, and the way you make these these clusters. Is you you throw in some uh, some starlight, some liquid starlight, then you throw in the um, some stardust and the the rock crystal, or one of each. And after it doesn't take very long to 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 turn into these. I think like I like I did ten here, and I started off here, and I think by the time I was done, there was like five of them that were done already. So it, it only takes like 30 seconds or something like that to, to even get started. So they eventually grow over time. As you can see, like this one, and it seems to be random. Like these ones are really small, uh, whereas these ones are, are rather large. And I believe once they start getting those white particles coming out of them, they're ready. So I'm going to go ahead and harvest these. I think I have to use pickaxe. Gotta hope this works. I've never done this before. Ooh, ooh! I got another Stardust and a Celestial Crystal. Excellent. This is what I wanted. Okay, yeah. So if there, where, there's another glowy one. Here we go. Let's get another one. Yes, yeah, so it looks like you get the Stardust back. That's nice. Uh, and then this one here, I think, is done. There we go. So I have now um, a couple of these crystals. Excellent. This is just what I wanted. So now uh, I should be able to make to make the new altar. So let me just uh, I'm going to use the one that has the lowest purity that which would be this one. Okay, the other two are going to go in there. Uh, I do have a lens. Which is good. So, to make that altar, that's not how you spell altar. Altar, there we go. <laughs> to make that altar, the iridescent altar. Uh, all right, I'm gonna need some resonating gems uh, and some marble. Uh, I have a bunch of marble here. I have to get some coal. Uh, I'm gonna have to make some resonating gems. I think it was four, right? For those, yeah, so we need to make some sooty marble and some ruined marble. Um, but other than that, I have all the stuff. So let me, let me quickly do those things and then I'll come back. Whoops, there we go. And, uh, where's my, where's my wand? Yeah, and we'll get that converted. Alright, I am back and I think we're just in time. It is sunset. I hope we have enough starlight to do this. Uh, no, that's not it. There we go. Uh, okay, so... 
let's let's get the ruined marble in. Uh, where's my chisel? Chisel. There you are. Okay, so I'm gonna need. I'm just gonna make a bunch. Bunch of ruined marble. That out of the way. Let's get that out of the way too. Okay, so this is gonna go in this kind of pattern. I think it was with the celestial crystal in the middle. And we had the lens up top, and right. So this stuff goes like this, and these go like this, I believe. Oh no, we don't have enough. <gasps> are, are we gonna? Is it gonna go up some more? Uh, I think it might. I hope it does. Oh, like so close to. <laughs> Please go up a little bit more. Just a bit. <laughs> I need to do this ritual. Once I get this done, I'm going to, to raise like this platform up, up higher in the sky so we get like a lot more of the starlight. Oh, please go up some more. Come on. A little more. There we go. Keep going. A little more. A little more. Eh. Come on! <laughs> so close! Oh, come on! You've got to be kidding me! More, please! <laughs> I need more! Crap, crap, crap. Okay. Um, we might be able to fix this. Uh, because I have another one of these. Another one of these. I think you can attach more. Of these to this crap. Uh, okay, so what is that? That's chiseled and arches, and that's sooty underneath. Okay, the spectral relay there, and that there. Please tell me that's enough. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, quickly, quickly. There we go. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that's pretty. Did it? I don't think it did it that that impressively before. That's really cool. Damn! Look at that. Yeah, I think I need to take a screenshot of this. Cause that's that's actually let's, let's take it from the side so I don't see the the ugly thing there. Yeah, that's like super pretty. Oh no! I missed it. Dang it! <laughs> Close enough. Wow. Yeah, that's. Oh my god. That is that is a thing. I yeah. I've never gotten this this altar before, so this should be this should be interesting. Also there's a wolf over there. So uh it's gonna be a bunch of work to do off camera. But I'm gonna go ahead and get this thing raised up to like I think it's like is it one twenty or one forty? Where it's like it's most effective. So yeah, I'm gonna have to do that. And I, I'm probably gonna build like a staircase coming from like over there or something. Um, but I think that should be good. Oh, so we've got to do that. Ooh, and that's all done. So let me just grab these real quick and I'll put down some more. And then what I want to do is I want to get extended crafting going, as fun as that sounds. Uh, so let's put that in there. Grab. Ten of these, put them down. Get these converted. Need a bit of food. There we go. Okay, so, yes, crafting. So, in order to make the journey map token, which I still need. I still need two things for. I still need the lamp of cinders, and I still need the ring of, as, uh, of ascent. Ring of ascent. Yes. Um. And so yes, I'm gonna need this. So the components are you know, crafting tables, block of iron, and then uh, there's these black iron slates, which are made from. Uh, which you make on the stone anvil from the black iron ingots, and that you make from. Iron ingots and crust black quartz. So that I already did in the um, the alloy smelter. Also, you need these basic components from your stardust, 
uh, iron, black iron sight, and iron rods. And you can see I already made some iron rods. Iron mod, iron rods are just made from uh, iron plates on the anvil. And then there's this, the basic catalyst, which is a bunch of these basic components around a black iron ingot. So I'm just gonna head on in. Oh, so we should have everything to make this this crafting table. Because I think these should. Oh no, that's right. I took these out. So yeah, so I'm gonna have to make these into plates. Just there we go. I'll go ahead and do it. Jeez. Every goddamn time. <laughs> I swear to God, the anvil. How <laughs> do you make the anvil again? <sighs> okay, so I'm gonna need some stone slabs. Let me, let me do this real quick. And there we go. All done. So, let's come over here. And let's look at the basic crafting again. Oh, right, I'm gonna need some planks to make the crafting table, so, uh, just some eight planks. There's some crafting tables. Done. Alright, so we're going to need, um, of these pieces, we're gonna need four here, and another four there, so eight. Just enough ingredients. And we're gonna need one of these. Oh, no! Oh, I smashed up too many. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm going to have to smell another one up real quick. That should be fine. I have... I just need to... This takes a little time to do. Yes, yeah, so you just throw in... Oops, I already had iron. Throw in iron. No black quartz. It just goes over time. So we'll just wait for that to be done. There we go. Look at how fast that was, thanks to the magic of editing. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and make this. There we go. And now we can make this. Da -da -da. One more achievement done. I have I have been slacking off on working on the achievements on, on my progression here. Uh, yeah, so that's done. So, once we get those, the, the, sin, the lamp, lamp of cinders and the ring of ascent, we will be able to finally unlock Journey Map. I know, I think it's like an age four or something like that. I, it just unlocks on its own, but I really want Journey Map. I, I do not like this map as much. I'm sorry. I just don't. Uh, this, this thing, that can go there. There we go. It's like the same size as a regular crafting table. I'm, I presume that we use this somewhere else as well. Yeah, so that's something that'll work on. Um, right, so I'm gonna go ahead and I don't think I have anything else planned for right now. Yeah, so I'm gonna oh, open, open. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, work on that off screen, and uh, I will bring you guys back once that's done, and hopefully, hopefully once it's up there, we'll have lots of starlight, and we'll we'll be able to get started on the. Um, the wand. The wand and maybe the mantle. We'll see. So I will be back <laughs> shortly for you guys. Not so shortly for me. So I have a, I forgot that I have I have a little story for you guys. So if if you were I don't know why you would notice this, but um you'll see that I only have five levels, whereas in the last video I had sixty-eight. So that can be attributed to the Tome of uh, Praticia. Kind of. So, as you can see, there's only nine levels starting it. What happened to the other, like, 50, no, yeah, 59 levels? <laughs> ah, so, to make this, to make this book, you need, um, you need an arcane scroll, which Mountain Papa was kind enough to give to me. Uh, because I had I had not found one. He's like, oh, I have some extra. So he he came over. He handed it to me. 
Um, and then so I set about making the components. And I was making these these slates here in the here in the blood altar. And you know, I was just <laughs> I was standing around sacrificing a lot of blood uh, for it using using my sacrificial dagger there and minding my own business. And you will, normally I don't care like mobs like they they like don't hurt me like they they basically do like almost no damage to me right now. Well, I just sacrificed a bunch of health for this thing. Just I was just standing right here. I was just, you know eating, waiting for my health to get back up. I had a heart and a half. A freaking creeper comes up behind me <laughs> and explodes. Normally, because of my armor, I would have taken very little damage. But he did just enough, just enough to kill me. And I lost, like, <laughs> I came, when I came back, there was only seven levels on the ground. I lost 61 levels to a freaking creeper. <laughs> I was just, oh, uh, I couldn't believe it. Anyways, I managed to finish this thing, and now I can actually store my levels. Which, thank God. <laughs> I just, oh, I can't believe I lost, like, that many levels. It was, I was, like, so disappointed. <laughs> it was very frustrating. Oh, so anyways, I get back to it. I just want to tell you guys that story, because I'm sure you found it very amusing. So... <laughs> I had to get back to what I was working on. Okay, I'm back. So, as you can see, I've been, I've been a little busy. I, uh, I made a, a platform out of diorite here, uh, way up at, uh, I think this is like 121. Uh, so 120 is what you have, is like the, like the maximum amount of, uh, of style that you're gonna get. So, yeah, so this is at 121. So, yes, I got this set up. Uh, I wanted to make a couple things while I had the chance. I, 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 you can move these crystals. Uh, yeah, it's fine. It's fine to do that. So, let me go ahead. I want to make an illumination wand. So, that is illumination powder, some rune marble, rock crystals, stardust, and resonating gem. Let's go ahead and use that. I don't know what it's pointing to over there. That's pretty. It wasn't for the rain. There we go. There's our illumination wand. Now, the other thing I wanted to make was... So, I went ahead and got this nice little crystal. So, out of all of uh, the ones that I got here, this one uh, just happened to be 100% purity. So, I was like, well, I'm going to use this one. So... Uh, I cut it down so that it was 100% cutting, and then I use I um, just uh, put it in a block of starlight over and over again until it got to 900 size. So this is, this is a perfect crystal because what I want to do is I want to make one of these collector crystals. So I'm gonna need uh, four stardust, four resonating gems, four illumination powder. So I think yeah, I'm just missing the stardust. Two, three, four. There we go. This this is gonna be awesome. Okay, so that goes in the middle. Uh, what was it again? Right. These in the corners. Uh, these up here, and then these over here should be it. Yes. All right. Let's do this. Now this is going to replace this uh, this not so good crystal that I that I put over there because it's just I d I didn't realize that that you needed the stats to be to be higher in order to get you know better return but with this collector crystal um, I basically should be able to cast wow the thing's huge I should be able to uh, to have enough starlight to cast it pretty much any time. So let's go ahead and break this one. Yeah, see, I still got it. It's right there. Yeah, look at that bad boy. Okay. 
Uh, oh, I wish I had. I wish I had a couple blocks. Uh, hold on, actually. Nope. That's not what I wanted. I just want to raise it a little higher so I can put stuff underneath it. So let's go like this. Oop, there we go. Now, if I use oh, this right here, the linking tool, and then link it to that, that should work. Okay, let's put that back. Hey, okay. I just does this. I don't know why. I have to like place it first. There we go. So I mean, I can't tell right now because obviously it's it's night and such. But yeah, this should be. This should be quite quite the crystal there. So I think. Uh, oh no, I don't. I don't have any uh, more iron left to convert. Yeah, so that's done. So there are other things I wanted to make. Um, so if we look at wands, um, I was actually looking at this and I think I want the Avatos one as well as the Visio one. So I actually made, I made a second resonating wand. So we can go ahead and make this. So yeah, I have all the stuff in my inventory. Okay, so let me just lay this out real quick here. Now, if I'm doing this right, uh, I've never actually gotten this far in Astral Sorcery before, but I think the, the the saplings go here on the uh, on the relays because they're like outside, and I'm pretty sure that's what that means. So I have all the other stuff ready here. So I think I think this will work. Let's let's find out. It's very shiny. Oh, oh, that is very shiny. Hold on, this this deserves a screenshot, I think. I wish it wasn't raining, because that is super shiny. <laughs> so I think it eventually absorbs these uh, these items on the spectral relay, one by one. Oh, yep, yeah, there they went. And there it is. So, check this out. <laughs> Wee! As long... Oh my god, that is so cool. I didn't even know it did that. As long as I have this in my hand, it... Yeah. I can... I can just, like, walk in the air. And, like, it doesn't require anything. It just requires this to hat. Now, if I switch to another one, obviously I'm going to fall. And that's, like, that's the only way you can go down. So, yes, I think that is that is very cool. Yeah, so that's gonna make that's gonna make um, like any sort of like flying go faster. Uh, and then the other wand I wanted to make into the Visio one. Do I have the materials? I think I'm out of aquamarine. Yes, I do not have enough aquamarine, but. Uh, now with this, it should be a lot easier to go get the aquamarine in um, the, the deep dark. I think that's what it's called. It's been a while since I've been there. Uh, oh yeah, let's check. I mean, it's not maxed out, but that's still that's still quite a bit of power considering it's probably midday and it's raining. Yeah. So I I, I think I think this thing. Is pretty awesome. This is this is a good thing to make. Yeah. So I'll store the other crystal in here, and now I guess I'm gonna go uh, find some aquamarine to make the other stuff. Yeah, because to make the um, to make the mantle like I wanted requires more of uh, the aquamarine. So. I'll be back once that is done. Oh, oh, before, before I go, actually, I want, I want to show you guys something real quick. I just remember this. So, I have, 
remember when I accidentally um, attuned myself to uh, uh, this is Dissidia. Yeah. Um, one of the things I got is increased swimming speed. Uh, okay, which one? There, that one. Uh, yeah. So, between the increased swimming... Okay, and so my armor, because it has prismarine, it also has swimming speed. Watch this. Whee! <laughs> that is ridiculously fast. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just, you know, I, sh I should live in like a w uh, an ocean biome just because of the speed. Oh my god, that's ridiculous! <laughs> like fling myself out of the water goes so fast. Anyways, yes, going to the uh, deep dark now to get aquamarine. All right, I am back from the deep dark, and I have a boatload of aquamarine. And I already went ahead and turned the, some of them into resonating gems. So we can now make the resonating, the Visio resonating wand and the mantle of stars um, Visio. So uh, first thing I'm going to do is put in my tune crystal for Visio. Yep, there it is. Now, to make this, okay, so we're going to put that in the middle and then. Uh, sugar cane air. Oh, I didn't grab arrows, did I? No, no, of course I didn't. Okay, it's not there. Uh, I already forgot. Dang it. <laughs> okay, out top and bottom. Sugar cane. Uh, I'm gonna have to go grab. S okay, I'll let me put the rest of the stuff in, then I'll go grab some arrows. Um, wait, 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 wait. I actually might have arrows. No, why am I carrying these around? So, I don't need those. Anyways, um, anyways, uh, okay, so aquamarine, feather aquamarine, uh, aquamarines here, feathers here, and then we're gonna need to put feathers on the um, relays around here. Oh! Oh, I didn't even see! There's just, like, this faint outline. There, that's cool. Okay. Um. What else? Anything else other than the arrows? Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay, I'll be back with two arrows. Okay, apparently I had to make the arrows, so I didn't have any. Um. Oh, seriously? <laughs> so close to making it. All right, we're going to have to... Oh, yeah, it is, it is high noon, so fair enough. We're going to have to wait till it gets uh, probably closer to sunset. Um, yes, I got to use this to make, to make the mantles anyways. So... We will just, we'll just wait a little bit. Um, I guess I will make sure I have all the materials for this. And then I'll bring you back once it gets darker. Alright, the sun hasn't even finished, uh, hasn't started setting yet really. And we're good to go here. So, let's go ahead and get this started. Ooh, pretty lights. That's gorgeous. Screenshot! <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't take too long to, to complete. There we go. And there's our wand. Okay, now let's do the mantle. Uh, so we're going to need to put... Oops, nope. There we go. Okay, so first we have to make the mantle. So... Tunic, Illumination Powder, Crystal... All right, and around it, we need to have feather, um, ingot, star, star mill ingot, feather, ingot, dust, enderpearl. So, feather. 
don't think I don't think the position matters. Ender pearl and ingot. That should work. Uh, I think it's working. Wait, what? How did? Oh, that should be a feather. Is that what that's saying? I think that's what that was saying. Okay, so I guess it does have to be in a certain position. That's interesting. Um. Oh, and that has to be the Ender Pearl. Okay. Will it work now? No, nope, this has to be the dust. Okay, I guess I guess I was wrong. I guess it does have to be in uh, the right order. But at least it's telling me where things should go. So yeah, that has to be the ingot. Oops. Ah! No. I had it right. There. Okay. That should be good now. I hope. Whoa, whoa, whoa! This is this is looks even more sh shinier than the other one. Check that. Out. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> I missed the screenshot. Dang it. Anyways, there is the mantle. Awesome. Okay, so mantle is now made. Now we just have to attune it. Now is it is it the right stuff? Ah, oh, it's not. Of course not. Okay. Fine, I'll just- next time I'll just keep the stuff in my inventory. Uh, okay, so here goes the string. Oh no, here goes the sugar. There we go. Is it gonna do this one next? Oh, this is- wait, what? Yeah, sorry, this is the string. There we go. Okay, so then the fish is in the right spot, right? Yes. I don't know how it does that. Anyways, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Another screenshot. Make sure it's nice and centered. There we go. Yay! Alright! Now we have a mantle of stars. So if I switch this, put this thing on. And if I get. No, not that. Uh, yes, this one, the Vissier one. This. I should be able to, well, fly with this. Let's find out. Oh, I have no idea how to fly. <laughs> Wait, I have my slime boots on. Oh, I guess I, guess I hit too hard. Uh. Yeah, I don't actually know how to fly. How do- because I think- okay. I think it's supposed to, like... It's supposed to operate like, um, uh... Oh, what do you call it? It's supposed to operate like the elytra, but I've never actually flown with an elytra before. Okay, let's try this. How- there we go! There we go! I'm flying! Whee! I should be able to go like this some more. Yeah, look at that! That is awesome! Look at me go! Okay, so is it... I have no idea how to turn this off. <laughs> I, how, how, how do I make it stop? Shift? No, no, that does nothing. Ow! <laughs> I'm gonna have to learn how to fly by Elytra now. That was that was pretty cool though. Let's try it again. Let's go up. And I just okay, so I hit space right to get it started. And how how do I make it stop here? Shift does nothing. Um, space again. I don't know how to land. <laughs> Screw you, I can fly. I, as soon as I figure out how to fly. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I can fly. 
Not quite sure how to land. <laughs> Whee! Damn! I yeah, this is pretty awesome. Okay, we're gonna work on the landing. <laughs> oh god, I got so fast! Ow! Ow! I got so fast! No! No! Dang it! <laughs> okay, go away! Go away, you! Ah, all right. <laughs> I think, I imagine this would just work, um, let me switch back to this, with the, uh, with not wearing the, the mantle, so if I just had this on, because it should work, right? Just use my slime boots, or when I don't hit the water, I should say. Let's try this. And I can use it in midair, too. Yeah, this will work out nice. Okay. Cool. That's... You are riding a horse. Alright then. That was a thing that happened. Yeah, so can I just go... Oh, that's... Okay, so go up, basically. Go more up. Wow, that, that goes really high up. Okay. Yeah, this will be good for traveling around fast, I think. Awesome. All right, so that was those are basically the things I wanted to make uh well right now from go, no. <laughs> right, right now from Astro Sorcery. Uh, and particularly I want to use these to make traversing the uh the Twilight Forest and the um the Betweenlands faster because <laughs> uh, well I mean, I do want to finish off age two here because we are we are close. We are very close to doing that. But I also really want the journey maps. I really want the journey maps. Um, and to get that, we need the iron apple. I think it was. Let's see, apple. Yes, this is the one. Yeah. So we have the charms. Uh, we can make that. We have map focus. Empty map is easy. We have that. Um, we have the magic map focus. So we need the ring of ascent. And we need the lamp of cinders. Lamp of cinders, I think you just have to defeat a certain boss to get. Ring of ascent is going to be a little hard to... I think it'll be a little harder to get. Um, yeah, so it's found as loot from chests and shrines, crywalk towers and white fortresses. Um, or loot from bosses. Yeah, so that that might be a little a little harder to get. But um yeah, these these things that I got the two, the two wands um and the mantle should make should make my job a whole lot easier. That's what I'm hoping anyways. Um so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed all that and my promise will be I'll be off astral sorcery. For for a little while now, <laughs> we'll be doing much more because it was it was quite a lot to get there. Um, yes, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and uh, take care, everyone.